two, one, charge! All six robots in motion. Everybody makes it to the courtyard. 5198 flies into the tower again. Let's see if Shockwave can connect on their shot. Up and no good this time. 25-21 Cert doesn't quite clear the auto work, so it'll be 30-22 for Blue as we begin the teleoperated period. 4488 quick to gather their own rebound. They're gonna move into position. Not sure if they'll go high goal or low with that, but their alliance partner goes high, and it's Fred up top for the Blue Alliance in five more points. 15-10, the Wildcats looking to match that. They go high as well, and Shockwave hits one also. High goals coming fast and furious in this match, as it is 40 to 32 in favor of the Blue Alliance at this point. 51-98 and 44-88, both back into the neutral zone for new boulders. 38-12 is playing defense. Bits and bots trying to disrupt the Blue Lions scoring, but no problem for Shockwave. They put another goal up high as Cert heads over the rock wall and into the blue courtyard. Progress being made towards the breach for both alliances. Shockwave through the portcullis this time, pushing Bits and Bots out of the way to see if they can get to their preferred scoring location. Meanwhile, Night Tech all alone at the Red Tower. They're gonna try to drop a boulder into the low goal. Cirque goes flying over the Cheval de Freeze. A Shockwave goes high, and the Blue Alliance extends their lead. 15-10 misses on the Blue Tower. 70-47 to now for Blue as we come under 60 seconds remaining. Neither alliance successfully breaching yet, but Fred makes their way through the Sally Port. No crossing awarded there. 4048 handles the Port Cullis, though, and that'll get the Blue Alliance their ranking point for breaching. Cirque gonna try to contribute by taking care of the Cheval de Freeze. 4048 up top once more. 1510 gonna try to follow suit. They're lining up. 4488 already with another boulder in their possession. 1510 misses. Shockwave goes high. Two for one right there. And we've got a 92 to 52 lead for Blue as we come under 30 seconds now, 20 seconds to go. Looks like Night Tech is all hung up on the ramparts as Shockwave puts yet another one up. Fred able to free their alliance partner and then head into the courtyard themselves. Red Tower is weakened. The Blue Alliance may be able to capture right here. Red Alliance gonna surround the tower, but that strength is at seven, no capture there. And as the buzzer sounds, Outstanding performance for both alliances. We'll see what happens with our final scores. Don't go anywhere. Results are up and the victory to the Blue Alliance, 112 to 72. All four ranking points from Blue. The win, the breach, and the capture.